kicking up in here for all you succubi. This is tavern music for the Lion's Pride. But before we get into it, let me just tell you, I am Finbar at Finbar Bass. You can click on the little bass tutorials right down there, the little clicker box, and get some free bass content that is not on YouTube at all. Um, other than that, let's roll up on into here and on top of the Lion's Pride. Bam. Nice little ditty. All right, so you're gonna start out on the ninth fret of the, uh, of the A string. And then you're going to go to the 6th fret, all the way to 6th fret to the G string. So skip a string, go to the G string on that. Hit that one again. 6th set, 6th um, fret on the G string, right? Then you're going to go to the ninth fret of the D string, and then back to the 6th fret of the G. So it looks like this. Real slow. Right? And then you're going to hit... You're gonna do a little run here. So you're gonna hit the sixth, the eighth, and the ninth. Then you're gonna slide it up to the eleventh. Right? So you got six, eight, nine, slide up to the eleven, then back to nine, eight, six. So it's then you're gonna bring it back to the ninth fret of the D string. So those together. Right, I'll do it slow. And then next phrase, you repeat the first. And then you're going to hit the 8th fret of the G, followed by the 6th fret, right, 8, 6, then you're going to hit the ninth fret of the D string, right, then you're going to go hit the 6th fret of the, uh, of the D string, and then the 7th fret of the, um, of the A. Right, you got that? So it's... So it's... And then you're going to go back to the 6th uh, fret of the uh, D string. And then you're going to hit the ninth fret, actually, right here, of the A string. So all together... Right, and you're going to hang on there for a second. And then you're going to repeat. So the first two phrases that I showed you, you repeat those again there. And then you're going to go into this ditty right up in here where you go. Um, so it's so I'll play the first two so you figure out what it sounds like. What is that? That's seventh fret of the G, followed by the ninth, and then the seventh. Whoop. Then you're going to go to the sixth fret of the G. So seven, nine, seven, six. Hang on there for a second. And then you're going to go to the ninth fret of the uh, G uh, D, then the seventh fret of the D, then the ninth fret of the A. So it looks like this. And that completes the first half of that. And you know, a couple of the measures repeat, so it's not that bad. If you keep practicing this over and over again, it may seem like, oh my God, there's so much, there's so many notes. It's a, 
but a lot of the rhythms kind of repeat and a lot of the, the phrases actually repeat. So it's not that bad if you just do it over and over again. <clears throat> the next part, you're gonna kind of repeat this rhythm, right? The first rhythm I showed you. That's actually the first phrase I showed you, the first measure. But you're gonna do it here instead. You're gonna go um, start on the sixth fret, right? And then slide up to 11. So you're gonna start on the sixth, slide up to the 11th, then say 11, nine, 11. Just like this part. <clears throat> and then you're going to start on that 11th fret, right? Which is just like the second phrase that I showed you uh, in the beginning there. And what this is, you're starting on the 11th, you're gonna go 11, 13, 14, 16, right? slide. So 11, 13, 14, 16. Then you're just going to go back down 14, 13, 11, and then to 9. Oops. Just like that. And then you repeat the first part. So the whole thing... And you'll notice I'm putting vibrato on these notes. It just makes the, the, the longer notes sound a little bit sweeter. Uh, then we're up to... Okay. Then you do one of these again. And then what you're going to do is you're going to start on that 11th fret again. You're going to go 11... 13, 14, just like you did just before, right? But then you're going to go to the 11th fret of the D string. See that? Sort of melancholy sounding note right there. And then you're going to go to the um, 13th fret, I'm sorry, the um, 14th fret, and then the 13th fret of the G. Then, of course, you do the again, and this part again, right? And then the la very last part, the very last measure, is pretty sweet. You are starting on the 14th fret of the G string. This is all in the G string here, high notes. I'll just show you. It sounds like this, or it looks like this, I should say. Looks and sounds just like this. What that is, is I'm on 14, then 11, back to 14, up to the 16th, right? And then you're gonna go to the notes we already played. You're gonna go back to the 14, 13, and 11. Just like that. All right, got some World of Warcraft pumping out for you right up in there. Um, don't forget, you can click on my little bass tutorials right down there if you want some bass tutorials that are not on YouTube at all. And there's some lessons, and they're free. And uh, you could also subscribe to Finbar Bass right up there. I think that's where it is. Something, somewhere up there. If you want to get some uh, tutorials for more uh, song tutorials for YouTube, probably some more Warcraft stuff coming your way. Other than that, have fun with that one, yo!